get my co-committed. I think unless you're Linus or you're maybe you predate Git and you were using CVS and then you're using SVN and then you decided to switch to Git, unless you're one of those, you know, elder states people of our community, pretty much all of us have to use Git before we're going to understand Git, right? Like nobody has like a, a four year degree in Git and then they start coding, right? Like you're coding and you're like, I need to share this. I need to, I just want to get it out there. And so almost all of us start just by memorizing a handful of things that you can do and having no idea how it works. Yeah. And just like, here's this incantation. And then when this messes up and the design, the API of the command line tool, somewhat obtuse, it's gotten better over the years. It used to be very unintuitive how you would, for instance, delete a remote branch by get pushing the branch <laughs> name with a colon in front of it. I still don't know why. There's a reason for that, I'm sure. But yeah, as you use it, you know, first you start off just memorizing the commands. Then you start emulating people who have been around longer. And then you start to kind of understand how it works. And it does become less intimidating. But you still aren't sure if you're using it right. 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 <laughs> 